Hey, what's up, everybody? This is House Martin Jr., your real movie critic. Today, I'm going to be talking about Atomic Blonde. Now, coming into this, I really didn't know what I was um, expecting. Uh, all I knew, it was kind of like a spy film. But as, as soon as I got into it, it, it definitely started, started off with a bang, and it showed uh, what kind of film it was going to be. And honestly, I, was, I thought it was pretty good. I, I really did. It, um, it definitely had a neo-noir type of feel, even though it's a spy movie. Um, and I give the director a lot of credit for his creativity. I thought it was pretty awesome. And the director was a former stunt double. Can you believe that? And he made, and it was his first uh, direct, directorial debut for, for this movie. Um, also, Charlize Theron, as, uh, as a spy, she was awesome. Uh, I really enjoyed her fight scenes. And it's just the way she, she acted upon herself to, to be that spy that really doesn't care about anything. She was really, really, really good. Uh, and I give props to Charlize Theron for that. And um, the action was awesome, especially that one scene where it looked like it was all shot in one shot. It was awesome. It definitely, um, it, I really enjoyed the ground. It actually had, you got a little bit of everything from like James Bond type of style of action to up to like a Jason Bourne type of action only without the so many shaky camera stuff. Now to take it away from some of it, uh, you know, the story, it was a little uneven. It was, you know, it was a lot of kind of like minor plot twists here and there when dealing with double ages and whatnot, but it wasn't that bad uh, for me to not follow what really was going on. And also, you know, the villain was played by James McAvoy, and I thought he was kind of like your typical cliched old villain, especially in spy films. So he didn't really brought nothing new to the table per se. But overall, as a film, uh, I give him my real rating of four stars. I really thought it was really good. I, I didn't expect it to be that good. Um, I really enjoyed the action. It had some great fight scenes. And, and Charlie Theron is at her finest and, and acting in this film. And, um, yeah, it's a pretty good watch. I suggest you could, could go on ahead and watch it. Hope you all enjoyed my review. Be sure to subscribe on my YouTube channel. Also, check out my blog at realmoviecritic.com. Like me on Facebook at facebook.com slash realmoviecritic. And follow me on Twitter at realquirk34. Thank you all for watching. Until the next time, I'll see you there.